name is Grayson, and I, I was wondering if George Washington had any kids. So did George Washington have children? Well, the father of our country is the father of no children. Uh, that's the short answer. Um, but why didn't he have children? Well, again, we may never know, but we do have some theories. As a young man, George Washington traveled to Barbados with his half-brother Lawrence. Lawrence was suffering from tuberculosis at the time. And while in Barbados, George Washington contracted smallpox. It is a devastating illness. Uh, luckily, George Washington had a mild case of smallpox, but a common side effect of smallpox is sterility and that case of smallpox may have rendered him sterile. When he married Mrs. Washington, she was already mother four times over. She had had four children with her first husband, Daniel Park Custis, and there are some reports that she may have been injured in the delivery of her fourth child. When she arrived here at Mount Vernon with her two surviving children, well, that first Christmas, she and the children, all three came down with measles. Now, measles can have a devastating effect on a a woman of childbearing age, and it is possible that that would be a reason for the Washingtons not to have children. So we here we have three separate possibilities. Uh, maybe one of those is the reason they never had children. Perhaps it's something else altogether. But we know that uh, when they married, they had every intention of having children. And in the end, George Washington was a loving stepfather, step-grandfather, step-grandpapa, to Mrs. Washington's children, grandchildren, and great-grandchildren. Click the subscribe button below and the bell icon to get notifications for new videos about George Washington and behind-the-scenes work at Mount Vernon.